in East Granby. The sounds of the season have started. And this is a sure sign of spring. Cast, catch, release, repeat. Our objective is to provide as many opportunities year round for anglers, and so that's what we're doing. By the banks of the Salmon Brook, the Connecticut DEEP is off to an early start, meaning net gains for anglers across Connecticut. Broodstock rainbow trout. Matt Devine is a cold water fisheries biologist with the state. The new regulations where there is a removal on the closed season of trout fishing, so you can fish all year round for trout now. Uh, we had really favorable weather, little to no ice on our lakes. So we started January 3rd, and we haven't stopped since. And they stay busy. Between now and May, they'll put in about 500,000 trout in lakes and rivers all across Connecticut. From salmon to our prized sea farrell and brown trout, rainbow trout, tiger trout. Um, and we do have folks from within the state that we cater to, as well as from around the state and the country. As far as fishermen go, the state has seen a steady flow of new people come to the sport since the pandemic. Yeah, we've seen an increase in outdoor activity, in license sales, and folks getting outside, and really it's, it's the best medicine. We encourage you to go find those gems. And in these surroundings, the company line is to go out and just throw a line. This is what we want, people out, outdoors. We want to get the next generation of youth into fishing being stewards of the outdoors, and there's no better way than to come outside, catch or not catch, um, and enjoy yourself along the banks of a river, on a boat, with family and friends. It's really, it's, it's an ideal situation. In East Granby, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.